New at 6 o'clock, the Del Mar Fairgrounds, as we know it, could be due for a major facelift. The venue is looking for new ways to make money in addition to horse racing and the fair. As our 10 News reporter Laura Acevedo shows us, the fairgrounds wants the community to help decide its path forward. The fairgrounds is an integral part of entertainment life in Del Mar. But life at the fairgrounds could look much different in the future, used for more than horse racing and the county fair. How does this fairground best meet not just the needs, but the wishes and the wants and the dreams? of the San Diego region. Tuesday night will be the second of three community meetings where the fairgrounds is asking for input on what the future of the venue should look like. Del Mar Deputy Mayor Terry Gasterland will be there. We also have responsibility for working with Solana Beach in San Diego and the entire region. Things are already changing. The Surfside Race Place is being transformed into an entertainment venue. Cabo left Del Mar for downtown last year. This year will mark the end of the Del Mar Gun Show and racing has seen a decline in revenue and attendance. So can the fairgrounds be a leader in doing the racing well? That's going to be a real challenge for the fairgrounds. Gasterland would like to see affordable housing and hopes a planned rail stop at the fairgrounds would eliminate the need for parking. A fairground spokesperson says once all three meetings are done, feedback from the community will be compiled and presented to the board for consideration. In Del Mar, Laura Acevedo, 10 News. And if you can't attend these meetings, there is a questionnaire you can fill out to provide your input. You can find that on the Del Mar Fairgrounds website.